What's up guys, this is Digidoo22. I'm logging in again with Kirby. So, here we go. We're up to 23%. We are now a little traveler. Sounds good. Butter building. Oh, right. He's about to get blown up. Okay, so, from where we last left off, I unlocked a museum. If he would actually go in... I jump. Um... I jump. Not really needed in level 4. Stop flying. And it starts a off with a warp star already. Great. Do, 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 do. Great music. Wait, what? Meta Knight? Ah, uh, yes, I still wish these guys would give you an ability. Just cause, look at them, they're using the Cutter ability. Oh, you suck. Okay, him I can understand. There is no ball and chain, Kirby. Sword or parasol. I'll take the sword. Yes, I'll take the sword, please. Guess I should have taken the parasol. Gordo. One up with a cannon. I'll take that, maximum tomato, and I'll lose my sword. Get out of there, thank you. That was a fast level. I would have expected something else, something a bit longer from stage 4, but okay. What's this? Cowboy hat with a gun. Am I going western on you guys now? This is a quick draw. When the enemy draws, press the A button. If you press it too soon, you get a penalty. First up, what'll do? 17 seconds. Next up, some bird thingy. I gotta get faster. Level 3, the stone guy. There we go, that's faster. Bonkers. Okay. DDD. Ouch. I knew I had to be faster there. Got a one-up for doing all that. Okay, don't know what came over me there. Maybe it was all that western talk in the quick draw. That's actually one of the more... Oh, look at me. I'm invincible. I don't need my sword. And we use it to get through that scrolling castle section. I choose you, freeze. Arctic blast. Wow, 
smiling, so... So I can just block my physicals, and here's Bonkers! Our newest... sub-boss. Oh, phooey. Oh no no, I want to freeze. There. And he gives us the hammer ability. This weapon is very powerful. Use it on stubborn bad guys to clear your path. It can also clear out pegs. Sort of like you're about to see. Like this. Thanks for the one-up and the uh, free health. Right at the end of the stage. Whee! Okay, I messed that up. I goofed up there. Level 6. Okay, sounds good. Laser... and two troll faces. Ow! Come on. No! Gimme that. Thank you. Okay, I'm not sure if I need the laser for this stage, but... A wheel would come in handy right about now. Bafooey. Okay, hammer, let's go. <sighs> Don't know how I survived that one. Fire, sword, cannon, hammer... Um, I'll keep the hammer. Hi, Froggy. Fireball. Ow. Fine. That was close. Okay, uh, secret in here. Just for some health, but hey. Okay, glad I've got a speedy power like Fireball. Ooh, look, the green switch palace. Boing. It unlocks the egg mini game that I showed off already. Flame on. You stupid stone man. Zip. I see my favorite power-up. Cutter! With the cut boomerang. Wait a minute. Hmm. That was dumb. Oh well. Looks like some sort of a ghost. Cool! Please, let me sleep. 
a little more, please. The most useless but funny ability ever. I can't believe I got that on random. Oh well. Give me the cutter. Cause this place is finished. Uh, where's my up B attack when I need it most? That Diglett's gonna get it real annoying. So I'm gonna take high jump instead. Let's go. Hmm. I thought I mastered that. Oh well. Oh look, the boss. I'm gonna... Yeah, you know, let's go take him on right now. I don't know who this is. Sun and Moon? Okay, so this boss. When one's up in the sky, like the sun is right now, it'll be daytime, and only one of them will attack you from the sky, one of them will attack you from the ground. I think high jump is one of the worst possible powers to have for this. Fire. Ouch. This isn't good. Moon Boy's beating me up. And I thought it was the, the angry sun that gave me the problems. Ouch. Um, yeah. Um, what's in the museum? Oh, yeah, high jump. Don't need that. Let's just go back for this. Normal Kirby is probably your best power up. Ouch. Oh, phooey, I could have gotten a real good power up there. But I didn't. Heh. <laughs> This isn't good. Mix it up. Parasol. Again, not another... Not one of those abilities that I would suggest using for these. But, hey. Take what you can get, right? Time. Three times. Third time's a charm, right? This boss actually gave me quite a bit of trouble when I was younger. Ah, so Moon gives you Cutter. Yes, I would actually recommend Cutter on this boss. And let me guess, the sun gives you something like fireball. Or beam. Phooey. <laughs> Gotta love the boomerang effects of Cutter. Well, okay. No. And then 
Sun and Moon Collide. So, after we do the Kirby Dance and get to Grape Garden, I think that's gonna do it for a video. So, this is Digidude22. And I'm logging out. So, I will catch you guys next time on Let's Play Kirby's Adventure for the NES. Remember to keep it digital.